here on Appala in Apalachicola, Florida, on the shores of the Apalachicola Bay. I walked out here on this pier, and the first thing I immediately noticed was all this algae growing in and around the uh, emergent vegetation here. I had never seen that before in the bay, but I'd never been here before either. Come over here and take a look. So, I've only fished the bay out on St. George Island, which is what forms the outer edge of it. And, uh, you never see this out there. Um, you can pretty much be sure if you're in an, any aquatic ecosystem, regardless of freshwater, saltwater, river, stream, lake, pond, and you see large groups, large clumps of filamentous algae growing around, you can be sure that is not natural. It's almost never natural. Something is causing it. It's usually nutrient enrichment of some kind. You know, so the natural vegetation here is all that emergent stuff that you see all the way out to the horizon here. Several different, well, several, probably dozens different species. It's a very complex environment. Um, but you see that and you see it starting to grow around and all. And notice that where it is, the emergent vegetation is not. It's choking it out. And it's another clear indication of a problem. You know, and so here we are. I'm in a park in Apalachicola, the city, and uh, pretty clear they have a nutrient problem here. It's very strange that you don't see this out in St. George Island, because if I had to guess, I'd say more people live on that island than they live here, um, but it could be that this is where the current just deposits a lot of the nutrients. But at any rate, if you ever see veggies, uh, algae growing like that, you can be sure it's not natural and there's some problem causing it.